Prior to enabling the colorimeter application, ensure that you have saved a dark reference and a white reference while in scope mode. This ensures that your spectrometer is performing correctly. For best results, set the detector integration time to accommodate lighting, approximately 100 milliseconds. Make sure that the bell curve response view does not saturate at the top peak. If it does, then you should either adjust the detector time or adjust the sample distance. SpectraWiz must be placed in transmission mode by selecting the view menu, Transmission. You may then enable the CIE Lab Color Monitor application found in the Apps menu. The color of light is displayed using the CIE Lab Circular Graph for A star and B star. The L star is the color lightness and is displayed in the bar graph. CIE Lab Tolerancing can be used to determine color differences known as delta E. If a fiber optic reflection probe is moved across a spectral color chart, a data cursor can be seen to move in a circle around the chart. Most all of the spectrocolorimeter buttons are self-explanatory. This application allows the user to select CIE standard illuminance, A through D, in addition to fluorescent lamps. The default illuminant is D65. The data is compensated from a table providing the relative spectral power distributions for the selected illuminant. The save standard allows a particular sample to be loaded at a later time to compare with other samples. The new reference button allows you to take a re-reference of a standard white at any time. This should give an L value of 100 in the bar graph. Save sample allows you to rapidly record samples into a color data log file for subsequent viewing or printing.